What's going on guys, it's J-Ho bringing you a brand new video and today I'm going to show you guys my Nightfall and Weekly Crucible loot from last week on all three of my characters. So this week's Nightfall was the Undying Mind Strike and there was Solar Burn on it. It was a very tough strike in my opinion just because pretty much every single enemy deals solar damage. So a lot of the Vex and the boss deal solar damage. It was pretty intense. But still, we got some pretty decent loot for the week, so let's get into my rewards. Starting off on my Nightfall rewards for my first character on my Hunter, we ended up getting ourselves our first exotic of the week, and we ended up getting the Graviton Forfeit. And my teammate got an exotic as well, a Zalo Supercell Auto Rifle, so that was pretty good. That was a really good drop, both exotics on that first reward. Moving into my next character on my Warlock from my Nightfall reward, we ended up getting ourselves 12 3 of coins on that one and my teammate ended up getting a legendary ghost shell. So not really the greatest drops on that second one. And then finally for my last Nightfall on my Titan, this time we ended up getting a legendary helmet. So we just got a legendary Titan helmet at 305 and my teammate got a Jobber Hockey sidearm. So only the first reward was pretty decent on my Nightfalls. Moving on to my weekly Crucible loot for my first character, we ended up getting ourselves an NL Shadow Scout Rifle, and it came in at 310, and the perks were a Life Support and Reactive Reload, so pretty cool. I'm not really a big fan of this Scout Rifle, though, so I might just use it for Infusion, but it did come in at 310, which is, I believe, the highest attack value possible for a Nightfall tier drop, so that was pretty cool. And then moving on to my next Crucible reward of the week, we ended up getting an exotic on this one and we got a Hereafter exotic sniper rifle at 310, so pretty cool. Uh, not really the greatest exotic weapon out there, pretty unique one, but still we got another exotic, so that was really cool. And then finally for my last reward of the week, we ended up getting a Revelator hand cannon and it came in at 293 with hidden hand and partial refund, so... I'm not really a big fan on this hand cannon as well, so I'm probably going to end up dismantling it. But anyways, that's about it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. As always, like, comment, subscribe. I'm pretty excited. We got Iron Banner this week. He's selling some new stuff. We got the rocket launcher and the sniper rifle as well as the helmets and the gauntlets, I believe. So pretty exciting. We got Iron Banner and it's clashed once again, so it's pretty decent for solo players and... I'm excited for it. So that's about it for this video. Once again, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.